Hello and welcome to today's Make Eight Minutes. In this video, I'm going to explain the quick difference between going to a file's history and getting a previous version versus rollback. So as you can see over here, I've got a part which is currently version 7. If I right click on that file and select history, I can see the rich history and all of the changes made to this file in the past. So I'm going to click on version 6 and then select get. In this command I'm also going to select the drawing. So I'm going to get a previous version. Once I've done that, you can see the preview updates and you can see here in the web there's no cutouts. The version also shows version 6 which is an older version than the latest version which is 7. At any time if I'm not happy with version 6, I can always right click and select get latest version and it's along with its drawing or jump back to the very latest version in the vault. If I right click on the file and go to the history and I select a previous version, instead of selecting get, I now select roll back. Over here, I select roll back and you can add a comment and then click continue. I then get a pop-up message telling me about the item references that will be removed for the parent file. In this case, the parent file is the drawing. In this case, I'll click continue. The warning now tells me that all of the later versions than the one I'm rolling back to will be deleted. So then I click roll back to continue and click close. As you can see, it's gone back to a previous version which is version 6, but version 6 is now also the latest version. So that means it has deleted version 7. So get previous version, we'll go and grab an older version of the file. However, it will leave the later versions. Rollback will also go back to a previous version, but it will delete everything that comes after that. Thank you for watching.